Hello everyone. With this video lesson, we are going to discuss about methods, classes and object in Java. So let's see what it means as class and object. Uh, a class can be defined as a template for an object or sometimes we call as blueprint for an object. An object can be uh, an instance of a class, right? Uh, for an example, object can be any kind of a real world entity. It can be an individual or a, a thing. Uh, for an example, student, maybe book, maybe laptop, maybe mouse. All those things are comes under object, right? So if we are creating a class, which include all the characteristic and methods of that kind of object that is called as a class. And with using a single class, we can create same type of object. We can create multiple objects with the same type, right? Uh, let's see what is the example here. You can see here a car class has been created so class is the car with using this car class we can create multiple objects right the structure of the car is created by using class and objects can be either mercedes bmw audi whatever it is it is a class right it comes on the class okay so that's how the Class and objects are defined as. So class can be defined as any kind of a template or blueprint for an object. An object can be defined as an instance of a class. Can a class template? Website template download edit then template take a download karala ek ek kana ek ek vidhi tamanta awashya vidhi edit karala tamanta awashya vidhi web ekak hada ganna puluwa then e ek ek kana hadana ewata kiyanne object kiyala ekak dan man hadana ekane me ogol hadana e wage wenas wenna puluwan ewa objects habai api hamoma pavichchi karanne ekama template ekak eka thamai class ekak kiyana kiyan hari da etakota java wala class saha object kiyana concept ekak ohoma thamai wenna so when we talk about objects, object include main uh, two things we call it as methods and data. These data sometimes we call it as attributes or fields as well. Object data attributes methods. These data or attributes, or as we call it as field are used to describe the characteristic of each and every object. Object is the characteristics to uh, describe the properties to describe the data attributes. Methods are used to perform some operations. Methods are used to take functionalities, operations, include methods. Right? So those are the main concepts when we discuss about object and classes, right? Okay, uh, so let's move further. This is the general form of class. As we discussed, uh, it should be start with class. Class can keyword and then it can have a name. The class can have a name. And then there can be some data or is we call as attributes or as fields, right? So these fields or attributes or data we call as instance variable because these variables are defined inside the class but outside the other methods, right? So those kind of variables we call as instance variable. And then uh, you have several methods. You can see here, then you can declare different types of methods and inside methods, you can add your specific operations, right? That's how the structure of a class is shown here. 
okay uh, then let's try to create uh, some classes and let's see what kind of methods are there right okay from this video onwards i'm going to use the netbeans rather than working with notepad right so let's see how the interface is uh, this is the netbeans window netbeans id id is we used because it's much easier than using just a text editor and because it include all the environment to execute to debug to run and it also gives suggestions so that it's much easier to use ids rather than just using a text editor right so this is the id that means id uh, here i am going to create a new project right and i'm select java application then i will add here a name for my project this is the name for the project right so i will name it as sample uh, object oriented programming and you can see uh, when i create a project it will by default create a main class now this is the main method and this is the class which is created by default right which include the main method now i am not going to use this one i will show you how to add another class you have to click right click here new java class right and here i am going to add student usual class we create and this is my class don't think about this public we will discuss about what is public later on when we are talking about access modifiers we will discuss public what is public and here the class definition is here and my class name student right and then you can add several uh, variables i told you that those variables are called as instance variables right okay let's try to create some variables string name okay string name int age uh, gender right again string index number so these are called as some kind of instance variables because it's created inside the class but outside the method right so let's try to add some methods as well now when we are adding methods method has several section let's see what are those section first you might have a access modifier right like public then me dala thiyena public wage access modifier ekak thiyena puluwa nathi wenna puluwa eka option na so we will discuss about access modifiers in later so because of that i'm not going to add any uh, access modifier other than public right public ken ek dan godak thiyena nisa ogolu danna nisa ma public ke access modifier ekak itarak danna anik ewa pavichchi karana vidiya man passe lesson ekak kela wenna and then you should have a return type ilangata api kena return type ekak kona kela right return type are two categories which are uh, some return types are there which return values while some are not returning any values samhara return type thiyenawa values return karanna pavichchi karanawa ඉතින් සමහර රිටර්න් ටයිප් අපි වැලියුස් රිටර්න් කරන්න පාවිච්චි කරන්නේ නැහැ. ඉතින් මේ වැලියුස් රිටර්න් කරන්නේ නැති රිටර්න් ටයිප් එකක් තමයි void කියලා කියන්නේ. right you can use void 
uh, if you are using void, it is not returning any values. So that means this method, whatever the method we are going to create, will not return any value, right? Other than that, you can use any primitive data type or reference data type here. It amatarava gulon to primitive data type on a makeup power chicken and pullon. Eva give a reference data types power chicken and not pullon. Any reference data type, for an example, you can use string as it. So, methane to add a pullon, string killer power chicken. Himanatta void. If it is void, void is the only return type which is not returning any values. All the other Primitive data types as well as references data types return values. Values return karano. Ani yeto na metha na void kya ni ko mam paavi chiga na pinna na ko hum na void dwelling api metha dega khadaaga ni kiya. Public void and then you should have a name for your uh, method, right? I will add my method name as cal. Total marks. So this is my method. Method name. And at the end of this method signature, we call uh, this as method signature. If you make it a method signature, you can make it a method And then you should start a curly brace and end the curly brace. Now this is your method. And make it a my method that we can again, right? Inside the method we call the method body. Here you can write your statements. Okay. I hope you got the idea of method. method You have to remember. You have to use parentheses here. Parentheses method of how you can know you can have a right and then i will try to create another method i will use the same access modifier public string now i am going to create a method which return value string now you can see that there's an error. It's because this method is returning values. Right? So that you have to use the return statement. Right? Methana void natu a venamokakari data type pick up pavi chicken nona, himata reference type pick up pavi chicken nona. You should have the return statement. Anivaring return statement take a tien no mold. Himanata mereka kinamukude, Mangarkiogi void there in the anit hammer return type pick up. My values return kernel. So methana string now, methana data type picker, string now. With any return can only a string type value vector. Okay, so whatever the return type here, it should match with the data type of the of the value which you are going to return. Right? Okay, let's try to create another method public in. Right now, this is a method which return integer type value. So, for an example, I will return as zero. Then, my method example like I will return as zero. Then, return as zero. Then, my method example like I will return as zero. Then, my method example like I will return as zero. Then, my method example like I will return as zero. But whatever it is, the data type of this value should be equals to this method return can value make a data type of all a method of how which you can return type of some other window and avoid the question because void 
uh, void type methods will not return any values but will return from in at the end i will try to write another example with using boolean right if it is boolean type uh, method it should return either true or false right for an example here i will return true then true em natha false thamai return karanna on right now inside this method bodies you can write whatever the specific statement then me method ekak athule operations mona hari statements ekak add karaganna puluwang oya right and you have to remember another one these methods here will not be executed unless you are not going to invoke it in another words i will explain if you are not going to call to this methods that method will not be executed wala me method ekak dan me class ekey tibba kiyala දැන් මේක ඇතුලේ ඔයාලා method body එකේ මොන හරි ලිව්වට එහෙම නැත්නම් මේ return කරන value එක ඔයාලා catch කරන්න මේ method එකට call කරන්න ඕනේ මේ method එකට call කරේ නැත්නම් මේ method එක execute වෙන්නේ නැහැ හරිද දැන් okay uh, here dosa uh, those are the things how we create methods and the math methods are done and then i need to talk about how to get parameters right so here inside this parenthesis you can pass set of parameters In parenthesis at the way all at a pull one parameters pass them so what is a parameter parameter is nothing else but just declaration of a variable parameter ekak kiyanne mena me wage variable ekak declare karana ek hari da e ayana mena deyak naha ekak here you can pass any amount of parameters ek yana ara wage variable declaration on karama ko yana ne pass karanna pulla right it depends on what you are going to implement inside the method wala method ekak athule implement karana ek anu walage pass karana parameters wenas wenna puluwa or else sometimes you might not pass any parameter so somehow you have to parameter set up but pass karanne nathi wenna puluwa right okay let's see here i am going to create a variable as m1 now this is called as a parameter just a method uh, just a variable declaration variable declaration ekak vithara right and then i will put a comma here Eight, M two, another parameter. Eight, M three, another parameter. Right? You can add any data type here, any combination of data type here, any amount of parameters here. Do you understand? Parameters, so the combination is called on term of parameters. Add karna kulo. ඕන ඩේටා ටයිප් එකක් යූස් කරන්න පුළුවන් මේ පැරාමීටර්ස් වලට ඕන විදිහේ ඩේටා ටයිප්ස් වල කම්බිනේෂන් එකක් ඔයගොල්ලෝ යූස් කරන්න පුළුවන් right okay now here i am going to print the total marks එහෙම නැත්නම් m1 m2 m3 කියලා තියෙනවා ඉතින් මම මේක කරන්න යන්නේ now i am going to uh, print the total marks internet so i will total equals here i am going to add up m1 plus m2 plus m3 right okay හරි දැන් මම මොන මම පැරාමීටර්ස් පාස් කරලා මෙතනින් මේ එක ඇඩිෂන් එක ප්‍රින්ට් වෙන්න දෙන්න කියලා දුන්නා. Now if you are not calling to this method, this method will not be executed. ඔයාලා මේකට කෝල් කරන්න නැත්නම් 
we made the big execute for a minute. Okay. Right. Uh, that's how it works. That's how uh, methods are works. We may with the parameters or other may have a method they can add Kerala Nikola, Homatamai methods, Hadan, the parameters cast Kerala Saha method, a Atulu Koma the execution make a win. Right? Okay. Then uh, I'll keep this for a while. I'll make a Mahima Matira. Let's see about objects. A pretty level discuss Kantin, maybe objects Kiana. Objects are done from how to create object, how to initialize object, object how to declare objects, request. We balm objects are done for home the kid, right? So, this is my class. We come on the student can a class which includes some common characteristic of each and every class student and some methods which is related to a student. Student connector related to methods sticker kui. Yeah, properties and ratanya identify karan pulang ya describe karana pulwa characteristic tiana variable stick kui mang hadala tiano student kin a class. Right? Now this is a class. All of you are comes under this student class. Well, I am on my student kin class. Right? But now I want to create objects for each and every student. Create a student ki. Uh, values assigned to the mama day object of mother had unknown. Right? The mother had unknown student one killer, the object, student two killer, the object. We did a killer with the objects mother had unknown. We all have more to make it objects other, all have more game values, a, a separate objects other assigned to the other night among them. Right? So let's see how to create objects now. Uh, now, since I want to execute that object and I want to call each and every method, there should be a place where I create my objects, which is executable. Then make class okay, make a bit of example and the heading okay, because it doesn't have a main method. Get the main method development, but you can do you can add the main method here. Go to make a main method okay. Right. I will show you that one public static void main and then string arg. Now this is my main method. Right? Then make my main method there. Then make a kissy brush Then I execute correct. Are error message in the but inside the main methods we have the Nothing okay. Main method they get the monarch macarna is a good thing. The output in the monarch in the head. Main method they get the there's nothing right. Okay, so though we have this class, uh, this method, it is not executable because we haven't invoked yet. We make a comma invoke curl and I will make a call curl and I think so. In case so, we have a people that are done, I could print in now. They are to call curl and I think so. So method main method देखो तो ना एक ऐसे लोग आप मनात call कर ला मनात कर ला नहीं तो इंसा किसी में output तक आप देना नहीं रहे right main method is also a kind of method main method देख क्या ने मैं यहाँ पे देख हाल को method देख आप मत आमाएं विनस आप ने एक कम है विनस main method देख इन तमाए execution में ना हटाऊँ ना नहीं तो main method देख तमाए इससे लाव entry point देख right methods of the thumb. Okay. Okay. Then uh, let's try to create an object here. We have main category object here. Khadana try karam. Right? But all our object here khadana now. First, you should take the class name. So my class name is student. Here I will take the student. And then you have to assign a name for your object. object You can give any name, but it should be meaningful. And then you have to use the new keyword again, student. Right? You have to remember that this is also the class name. This is also the class name. Right? I can make it a constructor. Let's see 
ඒක පස්සේ එහෙම ඉන්සරේ ඉගෙන ගමු දැනට වල මතක තියාගන්න this is also the class name and this is also class name ඒතර ඔයාලට ඔබ්ජෙක්ට් එකක් හදන්න ඕනි class එකේ නම තමයි මෙතන පාවිච්චි කරන්නේ here you can assign any name for your object and then you have to use name keyword and then again the class name right okay and then if i get this object and put a dot st1 කියන ඔබ්ජෙක්ට් එක ඇතුලේ දැන් so when you are creating an object inside that object all these variables these methods are there right okay you can make methods may variables ewa okkoma ara object ekak athule thiyen right okay let's see st1 dot can see index number age gender name all the things are there right okay now what i am going to do is i am going to call this मार्क्स राइट? integer type values let's say api den marks e metana gatte marks wala ekak thuwa ne inna marks walata relevant wena values tikak man metana pass karanna ekai the first one and the second one and the third one right okay let's see how this work now now you can see total is printed as 160 then me to make thiyala total එක 260 කියලා print කරලා තියෙන right okay and then i will show you how to assign values st1 from here for the name uh first i will try to print the name Let's see. Then you can see null because there is no any name is assigned. Then the object taken a da lava st one he st one ke na value object taken a da lava name me ka kabi assign kela na. So that I am going to assign name. Then mom me thena name me ka assign kela. Let's see. Come on. And then I am going to execute this one now. Kamal total is one sixty, right? So that's about methods and object creation. Methods are object creation. A B C D is my way, right? Usually, uh, in most cases, we are not adding main method here inside the same class. This is our main name. Uh, I can main method. They can main. I can make class. I can tell you how to do it. Because for a whole project, uh, only one main method is enough. I can project. I can. I can main method. They can keep both at it. Right? All the classes no need to have a different different main methods, right? So that I will get this one into another class. Mom, I can. I can appear main method. They can tell you how to do it. Mama. मेथडक्टेक्टेक्टेक्टेक्टेक्टेक्टेक्टेक्टेक्टेक्टेक्टेक्टेक्टेक्टेक्टेक्टेक्टेक्टेक्टेक्टेक्टेक्टेक्टे
the further details that means further how to create methods how to work with objects those things will be discussed in next video session with some exercise right thank you for watching this video session let's meet with the next lesson